get this, I freaking kid you not, I'm still in the city, right? And I'm just riding along, and I just, like, I heard this, like, Wee! and I'm like, what the hell? That was, like, an hour ago. But then it was like, I look up, and a freaking, like, eagle is flying above me. And it's, like, an hour later, and I hear the same noise again. And I look up, and, like, it's the same freaking eagle. It's just, like, following me. So, I don't know what that means. Um, I can't see it now. Last I saw it, it just flew around the corner of this building here. But it, yeah, there it is. I don't know if you can see that. Where is it? It's, it was just at the top of that building there. It was just along here just a second ago. But yeah, it's a freaking eagle in the middle of the city following me. That is so cool. There it is. Again. Yeah, there you go. You can see it right there. Just like hovering around this building. That's well cool. I have no idea where I am, but that's just like, what a freaking awesome view that is. Like, this is the train line right here, and there's like people down there doing something, getting photo shoot or something, but you know, the city's just back there and there's just, I don't know, that's just, well I better not drop my freaking phone down there, but I think that's just a, like well nice, wonder how I get down there, because there's like, um, ah, I'll see plenty of country once I actually like get out of the city, which I think is not too far ahead, because it's starting to get like less and less city like. Um, what time is it now? Uh, I can't see the, the time on my, because my camera's going, I can't see the clock. But anyway, that's well nice. Oh, okay. So I'm in like a residential-ish kind of area. And I just freaking just, I don't know how far up I am, but there's this hill. And there's this pain in my freaking legs. Oh man, because the seat doesn't go high enough on my bike, because it isn't made for freaking monsters like me. Um, the seat doesn't go high enough, so um, I've got to stand up. When it comes to hill, though, like from the lowest can stand up and power on. Oh, but I tell you, it's freaking painful. It's good though. Whoa, it's the stuff. Oh yeah. Um. Nothing else new to report, just ouch, ouch kabibble, ouch, and yes. But uh, look at the roads here, the roads are like wide enough, just wide enough for one car. So it's like when two people come by, like one has to like fully pull over, and they have to like sort of drive past each other like one kilometer an hour to make sure they don't freaking bump into each other. Anyway, she's like laughing at me. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna keep powering on. Um, yeah. Still in the city. Not sure. Uh, not too sure how much longer though. I'm pretty sure I'm approaching the outer limits of the city, but I have no idea. Oh, bunch of old lady. I look like a freaking homeless guy. Like I've just got like bags after bags on my bike, and I just look freaking homeless. But uh, oh man. Uh, what you guy? But this ride is gonna do me like freaking good. And it's just, oh, it's all downhill from here. Oh, oh, oh. oh man, I almost dropped my phone. Oh, oh, oh. That freaking hill was just, oh, that was freaking painful. Uh, oh, watch out. Oh, wait, no, I've got to go uphill. <laughs> anyway, look at this, this is just awesome. Just rolling, rolling, rolling. What? It's freaking sweet, but it looks like it's downhill from there. Man, i got to go uphill. Alright, uh, yeah I'll pause it. Look at this freaking area. This is awesome. So, when I went and did the schedule for my map, uh, for my journey, um, I could have followed the highways, but instead I chose to take all the little back roads, so, you know, if I wanted to see a highway, I'd catch a freaking bus. I wouldn't have seen this on the bus or train. It's well nice. I'll tell you what, you got to power uphill to appreciate the downhills. Whew.
Little girl just staring at the homeless man. There's like schools and stuff around here, obviously, because there's just kids everywhere. It's all nice. Alright, I'm gonna check my map. Pretty sure I've gone the wrong way. This is freaking nice. Like, freaking bamboo tree, well good. It's kind of hard to control one hand on a rough surface. Uh, I want to get up there on that road, that's where I want to go. But yeah, it's nice, man. Oh man, I'm buggered. <laughs> what a day it's been so far. Uh, what time is it? I think it's like, let me check my other phone. I think it's like three o'clock. Yeah, it's half past three. Nightfall is like six o'clock, I think. So I gotta find somewhere to freaking stay. I just, I'm just out the front of a 7-Eleven because they got, oh, 7-Eleven. Oh man, they just like freaking save your life because they have free Wi-Fi. And it's just like, I haven't got like, I've been fairly on track with, with what I wanted, but I got lost in like some park just before. And I found a 7-Eleven, just like, Doo -doo -doo, back on track. Awesome. I'm not sure how many they have along the way, but I've got most of the map saved along the way. Uh, I'm just like, I feel like something salty, so I just bought a packet of chips. Uh, but I just got into like a really nice conversation with, um, I felt myself cooking before, so I just like, lad I'm like sitting on the side of a highway, just like greasing myself up with sunscreen. Um, I just got into a, a nice conversation with two ladies, they were maybe, maybe in their 50s, one was in their 50s and one was maybe a 60s or 70s and we were just like talking and it was like like they speak Japanese I can understand like I get like out of a sentence I pick like maybe three four or five words and then I can sort of piece together what they're trying to say but then I can't respond like I can respond but just like basic basic Japanese and, and you know I say like I can understand it but simple Japanese I can like Kotairo is the answer yeah 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 um, but yeah, it's been, it's been nice so far. But I got like three hours to find a place to crash. Because I, I don't want to be riding in the dark. But we got uh, into a conversation about bears, and they're like, because I'm going to go like, uh, it's flipped on the phone, so I'll go, is it going to be flipped on the phone? Maybe not. Anyway, so you got Tokyo and Osaka. Um, or is it going to be the other way around on the phone? No, I'll do it this way. So you got Tokyo. Osaka. Uh, I'm going. I went west a bit. If it's backwards, my apologies. I went west a bit, and then I'm going to go south. Follow the water, follow the ocean, and then I'm going to come up, see some farmland, and then hit Osaka. Because there's like rice fields and stuff around here, apparently. So, yeah, I'll see some ocean, I'll see some forest, I'll see some farmland, and then I'm ready to hit the next city. Like, I don't want to go city to city with train and bus. It's just you know, there's noise and traffic and, and people. I, don't, I want to see some country land before I go to the, the second biggest city in the country. Uh, yeah, that was a nice conversation uh, I had with those two. And uh, yeah, three minutes. I think that's all I got so far.